okay, I'm going to take this bike apart and start cleaning and inspecting everything real soon, but I wanted to give you a quick update. Um, I've done a little bit of research. This bike does have a little bit of collectible value. Uh, 1982 was the first year that any mass-produced mountain bike came out. So this and the Specialized Stump Jumper. Um, the Specialized Stump Jumper obviously went on to be uh, more of a well-respected mountain bike than the Sidewinder, but it still has some value. I think it's probably worth anywhere between $400 and $600 if you were to try and sell this. It might take a while to find the right buyer. Um, but that being said, I want to know what you plan to do, right? My opinion is you're not going to hurt anything by making this a daily rider. But if you wanted to preserve a piece of history and hang this on the wall, that might affect what we decide to do, right? So, for example, I would absolutely replace these grips if you were going to ride it. Um, if you if these happen to be the original grips and you want to hang it on the wall, we would just leave the original grips on. You know, same thing with the tires. These might actually be the original tires, um, but they're a little bit dry rotted, right? So if you want to ride this thing, as I suspect you do, we'll go ahead and replace the tires. Um, a couple other things. You are right. These are not the correct shifters. These are for a seven speed um, and you only have five gears in the back. So I'll give you some options on replacing those. Um, the derailleur is not functioning right. So I have to figure that out. I'm hoping it's just not mounted right. You mentioned it got caught up in the spoke, so maybe it just got uh, knocked out of place. But if it's bent, we may have to replace that. Um, I do plan to rebuild the wheels. I'll just buy new spokes. They should be functional otherwise. Your front hub we'll have to make some decisions on. My opinion is let's... When I pull it out, I'll just clean it and polish it really well and see what it looks like. Um, if not, you know, we can make them some decisions on buying a new one. Um, so at this point, really, just let me know what you think. If you want to turn this into a daily rider or if it's something you want to hang on the wall and, and try and make it historically accurate. Um, even if we replace components, I'll do period correct and it'll still look good. And, and I'll give you all kinds of options and, and communicate with you before... Um, before I spend any money. Um, hope you're doing well. Talk to you soon.